before given a discrete random variable of this one so we can say that x follow a binomial distributions of so we see b is a represent binomial so we have this one is n p so from this one we can see that n is n we don't know how many n but here we know that it is 0.65 p is equal to 0.65 so here we have the formula p x is equal to r is equal to n c r p r q n minus r right so here we see here we have p is equal to 0.65 so we have q q is 1 minus p which is equal to 1 minus 0.65 which is equal to 0 0.35 so we have this one and we have this one. So here we can substitute. So it's given that A, find the value of N if it's given that P X N is equal to 0 0.0319. So here we are substituting R with N. So from the formula here, So n is n and c. So our r is n. You see here r is changing to n. So our p is 0 0.65. So our r is n. So q is 0 0.35. So n is n minus r is n. See I just substituting r with n. And then we because we have P and Q, we just substitute which is equal to 0 0.0319. So we know that N C N is equal to 1. You can yeah, you can try using your calculator. If it's the same number 3 C3 or 4 C4 or whatsoever, as long as it is the same, you are going to get 1. Right? So this one is 0 0.65 N. So 0 0.35 to the power of 0 because n minus n is 0, 0 0.0319. So we know that anything power with the 0 is equal to 1. So now we are left with 0 0.65n is equal to 0 0.0319. So here to solve this one, the only way we can solve it formula is using log. So we just add log at both sides is equal to log 0 0.0319. So n log 0 0.65 is equal to log 0 0.0319, right? Okay, and then n is equal to log 0 0.0319 divided by log 0 0.65. So here you are going to get... A. So now we, we know that n is equal to A. So you actually get 7.99 something. So you just take 8. Okay. So when you are using your calculator, make sure you close the bracket. Else you want, you will get error. Okay. So this one you get n is equal to 8. B, based on the answer in A, find P x is larger than 2. So we know that this one is equal to 8. So P x is larger than 2. So there is 2a. Eh? So you see here larger than 2 means it can be 3, 4, 5, 3 up to 8 which is quite long. I mean you don't want, you can calculate this one one by one. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 or you can just is equal to probability of 1 minus 1 is everything minus p x is equal to 0 minus p x is equal to 1. So you see here you have probability of getting 0 up to probability of x is getting 8, right? So you can choose because this one is larger than 2, it's probability p x is equal to 3 until p this one is equal to 8, which is quite a long one to calculate. But if you just take everything which is 1, because we know the total probability is 1, you can just minus which is not this one because we want 3 to 8, which is also equal everything minus uh, not including this one which is x is equal to 0 and then p x is equal to 1 okay larger than 2 right so 2 is included sorry so 2 is included so minus p x is equal to 2 
which is equal to 1 minus so probability of 0 so you just substitute inside here we know that our n is equal to 8 right so p and q also so p is 0 0.65 and q is 0 0.35 so when x is equal to 0 so the first one is supposed to be 8 c 0 0 0.65 0 this one and this one is the same rr and then this one is 0 0.35 so 8 minus 0 is 8 okay and then the second one minus 8c1 so this one is 0 0.65 so this one is 1 right so this one is 1 and then we have 0 0.35 8 minus 1 is 7 okay done and then the third one minus 8c2 you have 0 0.65 0 0.35 8 minus 2 so here you are supposed to get 0 0.9747